Noise insulation. Let's look at the different types of noise that come from a marine engine. Firstly, you have structure board noise distributed through the engine mounts and through the shaft coupling and through every part of the engine that touches the boat. Secondly, you have exhaust noise exiting the engine through the exhaust system and leaving through the back of the hull. Thirdly, and perhaps most important, you have noise distributed all around the engine, airborne noise. The way to combat airborne noise is with sound insulation material. Sound insulation material is fixed above and around the engine to create an acoustic hood and contain the noise, not unlike a telephone booth on a motorway. Let's look at the different types of noise insulation material. Firstly, the facing. The facing needs to be really tough. It mustn't pierce, it must keep oil out, and it must look good in five years' time. So you get three choices. Maritex, the best of the lot, just so tough it's not true, sealed against oil, reflects light, looks wonderful. Seal glass. A tough, fire-zero rated fiberglass cloth also keeps oil out, rather lower cost than the Maritex. Silver polyester, the economy facing, it keeps oil out, but be careful because it's quite flimsy and screwdrivers can pierce it. The next crucial point is the thickness. Three normal thicknesses are available, 12 millimetres or half an inch, where space is tight, it does an excellent job, it's not very expensive, but it's not the best. 32 millimetres, or an inch and a quarter, this is the industry standard, and the way in which it works is that the noise goes into the first inch of foam, the soft face lets it in, it penetrates the foam, it hits this artificial lead barrier, which both bounces the noise back into the foam to be absorbed and stops its transmission, and the final layer of foam is the gap between the barrier and the bulkhead, just like the gap in double glazing. So 32 millimetres, an inch and a quarter, absolutely the industry standard, does a, does a terrific job on a boat. Finally, more expensive, the twin barrier material. It simply does the same thing twice. Heavier, thicker, more costly, but wonderfully effective. Now about safety. The most important point about safety is fire. This material is going to fit right around the engine. If the engine catches fire, it mustn't. There's an enormous amount of nonsense talked about the fire ratings on foams and how much furniture burns. There's only one rating to go for, BS476, Fire Zero Rating. If you have BS476, this material will not ignite and it will contain a fire in the engine room. Let's have a look at how that works. If we peel off the backing paper and stick this to my hand so it can't move, then let's get a gas blowtorch. And this is a gas blowtorch which you'd use to strip paint off a window frame. And let's apply the flame to my hand. The, the, the flame coming out of the blowtorch is 800 degrees centigrade. There is one inch of material between the flame and my hand. That is what Fire Zero rating means. This is what safety means. BS 476, Fire Zero rating, don't use anything else.